Hi everyone and welcome back to Prefusion. I'm Anish and today we'll discuss the best strategy to get full marks on the subject engineering mathematics. So I will discuss about uh, tips and tricks and uh, which topics are the most important ones. First caveat I want to give is all topics are important, right? If you want to score full marks, uh, like uh, note it down, okay, sign it down. All topics are important. But for some reason, if you're busy or if you are like stuck in subject, uh, like stuck, stuck in some other subject and you are not able to complete the whole syllabus, which topics you should give more focus on, okay? At least you should not leave those topics out. Whichever you leave, leave those topics, uh, like you should not leave those topics out. And, and another important point is, obviously, if you don't do the basics, right? If, you're, if your basics are not cleared, then you will not be able to complete those topics. So that is also very important. If your basics of 11 and 12 is not clear, then the first thing is you have to mostly study everything basically so uh, we'll discuss everything we'll discuss about the roadmap and all those things so first let's come to the uh, each topic so i have already discussed about the course curriculum of each branches you can check it over here you can go go to the go and watch this video Wh what is your syllabus and all those things i've explained all this then there is a roadmap to cover the whole engineering mathematics in a month engineering mathematics and aptitude in a month okay how you can cover and you can secure 28 marks okay total weightage of engineering mathematics and aptitude are 28 marks so it is huge so that video is also present you can go and watch that okay in this video i will talk about the most important topics which you must not skip so in linear algebra like uh, linear algebra is divided in these basic topics okay and which are the most important ones from here so basis of matrix and determinant rank of matrix solution of linear systems of equation eigenvectors eigenvalues vector space uh, subspace and linear span so out of this right uh, if i have to obviously pick the most important ones the most important ones will be this eigenvectors and eigenvalues and solution of linear uh, solution of linear system of equations okay so here right you can find out whether the system of equation has unique solutions no solutions or infinitely many solutions there can be very good questions framed like this is related with the rank as, as well so they can ask questions from rank as well from this right so obviously many things are interrelated but if you want to ask me like which are the most important ones the most important ones are the these two topics you should you must focus on these two topics at least okay you you have to study all of this because linear algebra is very high weighted subject and except this fifth one right all of these are actually um, almost equal weightage but these two topics are the most important ones okay then let's come to calculus now for calculus basic thing is you have to study everything but a uh, few things uh, which i can say is you must focus on is uh, like this limit continuity and differential differential right this actually is syllabus of 11th and 12th uh, if you remember but in gate also they give uh, good questions and uh, those questions are not that difficult so this is also a topic that you should study well and this will only help you out it will only help you out on the later subjects monotonicity maximum minima is also a very good topic and you must uh, not skip this topic right? this is also a very important topic and questions from this topic also generally comes so i'm talking about over all the branches obviously i cannot do analysis of all the branches that would be just impossible i'm just uh, like uh, telling you as i have done the pyq solve the pyq of all the branches from the experience i'm uh, talking about all the important topics now mean value theorem taylor series mclaurin series, uh, series are important but uh, according to me not that but still it is important you can study that uh, i can rate it as one star okay then indefinite integrals not that important okay i will tell you indefinite integrals is not that important they may not uh, they mostly don't ask they may ask from improper integrals but they don't simply ask a question from indefinite integral okay generally uh, but they definitely ask from definite integral and area under curve so obviously for understanding definite integral you have to understand indefinite integral then uh, this multiple integrals is also very important like in this double integration falls okay uh, volume volume integration all those things falls right so this is a very very good and interesting topic so you must study this then improper integrals improper integrals uh, is not that important uh, it may uh, it may be asked because there is like this limit of sun, uh, sum then gamma and beta function these two uh, things are there gamma beta function what are these these two if you remember that's good okay so not that important according to me next is vector calculus so obviously if your basics of vector algebra is uh, good then that's good right like this topic is basically from 11th and 12th now gradient divergence curls curl is also very important so i will rate this as two star gradient divergence curls are very important these are easy these are scoring and questions uh, what i have seen is, is uh, when they ask questions from this uh, topic right from this gradient divergence curl they ask easy questions then integration of vector functions this is very important this is very important and this you should know this this and the theorems stokes cause divergence theorem green theorem and when we cannot apply the theorems okay how are the theorems getting used so all these things obviously i have taught so yeah these these two topics are very important and obviously gradient divergence color is also uh, important 
Next, let's come to a differential equation part. So, differential equation, there are like many topics uh, segregated. So, ordered uh, degree and formation of differential equation, uh, not that important, but obviously you should know all these things. Then, solution of first order uh, homogeneous and non-homogeneous differential equation. This is mo this is important and the higher order differential equation, right? Higher order differential equation and the solution of uh, homogeneous and non-homogeneous differential equation. These are important and remember higher order. What is inside our syllabus? Inside our syllabus, mostly higher order linear linear differential equation okay linear differential equation comes now method of uh, parameter variations all not that important you will cause differential equation you, like this is very short topic you can study but obviously these have these two has the highest importance according to me and like last one is partial differential equation okay now let's come to this uh, complex variable so in complex variable again your first topic is the basics of 11 and 12 if you have studied the basics of complex variables and then you can you will be able to answer without even studying engineering mathematics but uh, the thing is uh, like they they may they sometimes ask from this topic as well okay uh, they may but uh, not too, too much but sometimes they ask from this topic next is analysis of complex function yes this is very important this is a new topic and this must be studied from you this is a very very important topic then pole singularities you should know how do we find out poles and singularities to which will help you in the later topics okay obviously th this is in itself is not an important but to study these topics right like control integrals of complex uh, functions and then cauchy integrals cauchy's integral and residue theorem these topics for to study you have to understand the concept of zeros, poles, and singularities. So yeah, uh, so obviously th that is also that comes under the important topic only. But this is the most important one. This Cauchy's integral they may ask from this right. And when we cannot apply Cauchy's integral, how do we apply Cauchy's in integral? Like all those things you should know. Next is probability and statistics. Basically, in probability, right, almost everything is important. Okay, almost everything is important. Basics of probability is important. Uh, then uh theorems of probability is important and like why basis of probability is important because this right basis of probability actually comes in your aptitude as well in engineering mathematics and aptitude also both it can come okay that's why basis of probability is also very important then uh random variables yeah random variables and standard deviation variance this, this is also important probability distributions like most important probability distributions i can i can say uh binomial theorem then uh poison theorem then Gaussian the uh, Gaussian's no, sorry not theorem binomial distribution Poisson distribution Gaussian distribution normal distribution exponential is not that important although you should study but it is not that important and this basis of statistics right it is also not uh, uh, like that super super important but you should obviously prepare everything to score full marks but the most important topics are those which I mentioned okay so yeah that was uh, basically it and how should you cover basically right uh, it should not take you more than 1 to 1.5 months like you should cover two subjects in parallel okay uh, engineer mathematics with aptitude you can pick up or engineer mathematics with one of your core subjects or something right so and now is the best time to start engineer mathematics because i have launched my course you can see our course like uh, there are demo videos uh, like you can go and watch our engineer mathematics through playlist complete linear algebra is present okay uh, basis of calculus is also present basis of probability is also present on our places you can go and watch those videos you can uh, take the knowledge and concepts from that and you can proceed with our course like we have full course everything uh, complete syllabus we have covered like all the topics and doubt clearing group is also there everything is there i will just uh, link you back to the launch video of our engineering mathematics and aptitude course and there all the information are given okay so yeah that's it that's it basically from my end i hope you perform very well in your upcoming examination that is gate 2025 and all the best thank you